Hey guys, it has been, it seems like a really long time um, since I've done a video, but I actually think it's only been, well, it's been about eight days, I guess, since I posted one. The last one, I think we were out the lake. It was lake day and we did the mm, Turkish treats, I believe. Which took us a while to figure out where those treats were from, but Anyway, um, how's everybody been doing? Um, I've just been going back and forth from the old office to the new office, trying to get everything switched over. Um, finally, I'm out of the old office and I turned in my keys this morning. Um, I took a video of the empty office and um, I'll post it on here. Um, bittersweet, I'm gonna miss the people that was in in the building but as far as the office I'm not gonna miss um, it was very hot in there um, the landlords aren't the best the new owners um, so just wasn't taking care of it um, it was just right downtown and just a lot of stuff going on but um, like I said I'm gonna miss my neighbors that's in there um, but yeah, I'm here. I'm at the new office right now. Um, I'm on break. So I just figured I'd come on here and say hi. Um, I did bring three or four small packages with me because I ordered um, some stuff for the office. I don't believe these are it, but I was just, um, I just brought them and I figured, you know what, while I'm at work, I'll just come on here really quick and do a small haul. I don't think it's gonna be very big. Um, some stuff I may not have the prices. I don't know, but we'll see. Um, got my Stanley cup with me. And um, this is one of the shirts I got from Timu. I really like it. I didn't think I was going to like this, but actually I don't mind it at all. Um... I like it. I think I want to get it in some more colors. I don't remember how many colors they offered it in, um, but I'm sure that they did. So, all right, well, let's open. We'll start with the smallest package. Isn't that cute? I think this came from a local warehouse. I think. I think, I think, I think. to my glasses. Um, lip liner. Oh, lip liner stain. But I like the way that they spelled it. And I think I got a set of three. These were going, everybody's ordering them on TikTok shop. Um, and I wanted to look on here. I miss having my little bitty scissors and my cloud. I have one cloud cutter left, so I need to order some more. This is a, I don't think it's gonna work. If I don't cut myself. I did get my new desk up. Um, and I took a small video of that this morning as well. So you guys will be seeing it. I'll post it at the end of this video. And it has frosted glass doors. And I don't know if we just didn't get them on well. Or if there's we missed a seal or something to put on it. But it's a little bit noisy every time I... I don't know if you guys can hear that. Every time I bump it. Sorry, this is taking a little bit. I guess just a little bit longer I get to chat with you guys. Um. Yeah, some of these I've had for a little bit. 
so it's my teeth there we go but I gotta go to the dentist I just been putting it off but I really do need to one more so yeah I'm excited um, to be over here everybody seems really nice um, I really like my windows in here I can look outside the other one I couldn't even open the blinds because it was so hot Or if you guys can hear that. Man. I'm going to end up cutting myself probably. There we go. Okay. So let me see. I don't think the box has the colors but let's see let's see what I got I've been excited for these my hair is just everywhere today everywhere oh no this one is broken okay well I will ask for a refund on that one but let's see it doesn't have numbers on them but these are the colors oh. and um, this is the kind that you put on and then after a minute or so you peel them off so we will put them on and let them sit a minute and see what colors these are. So this one is, I'm going to put them right here in the order I put them on my hand so I'll remember. Oh, I'm bummed about that one, but that's okay. They're usually really good about giving the money back. But See how they come. I don't know why I always do it right here and then I'm bending. Can you hear that? It's gonna drive me crazy. I'm gonna have to figure out something with that. But while well, these are drying, I got another one. Let's open them and see what they are. What do these? And not there might be one item that's not from Timo in here. I did order some shampoo set, a set, um, and I don't remember if I've opened it yet. Nope, this one's it. Okay, this I got off of um, eBay. And it is the Nioxin um, hair system. It's like a trial kit. One of the girls I follow, uh, Cindy's Lifestyle and More, she uses this faithfully. And she said it's been helping her. So these just really are terrible scissors. I miss mine. Goodness, this is ridiculous. There we go. Um, but I got this whole system trial kit. And for all three pieces, it is a, for all three pieces, I paid $18.50. And it is a Nioxin system number four hair trial kit 
cleanser, scalp therapy, scalp treatment. And she uses the number four, so I went ahead and just um, did the same. And like I said, I think there is three pieces in here. And here is the cleanser shampoo. I'm excited to try it. Uh, scalp therapy conditioner. I'll move this over here. And scalp hair treatment. says progressed colored hair progressed thinning which mine just seems like it's coming out in clumps now I do know she said like it doesn't like lather I don't think I think that's what she said um, very well um, but I'll figure it out as long as it's gonna help and then I also started taking biotin so I'm excited about that. But the tr the um, trial kit, like I said, is $18.50. And after taxes and everything, I paid $20.03. Very excited to try that. Oh, goodness. I do got something else over there, but I'll do this one last. Yeah, the... Um, We'll end the video um, of the old building. I was walking every, I was just walking and filming. Um, and then I was walking down the hall because there's pictures of the building. Um, I want to say it was built in like 1903 or something like that. Let me look it up really fast. I'm pretty sure. It was like 1903, but um, in the video I was saying that it is haunted. The building is haunted. Um, there is two, I believe it used to be like an old hotel, I believe, but I'm not 100% positive, but there's a couple offices on the third floor and then most of the fourth floor. Um, people's have, people has had stuff happen to them. I, I was on the second floor and I never really had any, any type of experience, but my boss, when she would come down and cover me, um, the first time that she come down and covered me, I had bought, um, a shredder a little shredder like 12 or 15 page shredder and I had put it behind I had some um, oh it's terrible I had put it behind some chairs I had in there uh, because I tried to shred and you know clean up the office before she got there and then I just unplugged it and I shoved it behind the chairs um, just so it would be out of the way and everything so anyway and I think she had been there a couple of days and she said she kept hearing this noise and it was just driving her crazy she's like what in the heck is this noise so she started hunting around the office and when she pulled the chair back she in the shredder and she's like oh okay well it's just the shredder i'll turn it off well the wall that my chairs i had on and the shredder was behind there was no plug in there you had to run an extension cord and so when she pulled it to turn it off she realized number one it was off and number two, it was unplugged, but it was acting like it was trying to shred paper. So she got freaked out about it. She called her husband and she goes, this shredder is going off and it's turned off and it's not plugged in. And she goes, what, what, do you, what should I do with it? He goes, throw it in the trash can. She goes, I'm not going to throw it in the trash can. It's a malicious shredder. So she put it... Um, well, you'll see in the video whenever I upload it, there, there's a separate small room and I made, I made it like a little kitchenette um, area with, and then at one end it was a kitchen um, and then at the other end it was just a storage. So she just put it behind there and shut the door so she can hear it. 
Um, the second time, so I guess there's four things that's happened in my office. Two things happened to my boss. So that was her first time. The second time she covered me, she brought some type of crystals to keep in the office. And um, anyway, she said everything was going smooth until like it was like um, Thursday or something. And she was sitting at the desk typing and she said somebody yelled in her ear. It was just somebody yelling. Scared, she turned around, there's nobody there. She said it was towards the end of the day and um, she just got her stuff and left and went, you know, because they paid for her motel to stay while I was gone. So she left there, went and grabbed her something, went to the motel and called her husband and told her, told him, she goes, you know what? I don't know that I'm going to cover for her anymore. That office is just weird. You know, it's haunted and just seemed like it bugged her. So she said that when she got to work on Friday, she went into the office and she's like, all right, I know you live here and I'm here for one more day. I'll leave you alone. If you just leave me alone, dude, we just got one more day. And she said that the Friday went smooth, but I just felt so bad. She's like, you have been there for eight years. At that, at that time I had been there for eight years. And she goes, nothing's ever happened to you? I was like, no, nothing's never bothered me in there. But yeah, she just freaked out. She didn't want to come back and cover me. Um, the second thing, or the third thing that happened was um, I had to run some work down to one of my um, process servers. And we were, you know, like I said, we were downtown. It was hard to find parking. So a lot of times they would call and tell me, hey, you know, I'm downstairs. Can you bring me my work? So I went down there to bring the work. And I seen the UPS truck pull up. Didn't think anything about it. And um, so I finished talking to them for a minute and I was heading back up to the office. So as soon as I walked in, cause you have to go through a glass front door and then there's a small hall to the elevator. Mm -hmm. And then the elevator was straight and then the um, staircase was to the left. But anyway, I walked in the front door about the time that the elevator opened. Mm -hmm. And as soon as he seen me, he just, completely lost all color in his face. And I don't want to laugh because <laughs> um, I just felt so bad for him. But anyway, he lost all color in his face. And he goes, how did you get down here so fast? I just spoke to you in your office. I'm like, no, you didn't speak to me. He goes, yes, it was you. I walked in and I said, hey, um, I have something for you. And you said, I'm in the other room. I'll be right there. I'm like, it wasn't me. And I just started giggling, but he did not giggle. He's like, that is effing creepy. And um, so he just kind of, he goes, I, he goes, that just gives me cold chills. I don't like that because I thought I was talking to you. I was like, nope, it wasn't me. And um, so anyway, he left and I went back up to my office. I found the package and for the rest of that day, nothing, you know, ever, I never experienced anything. And then just recently, probably six or seven months ago, um, Wyatt comes to work with me quite often. And he was there and he was playing in the floor. And he said, Nana, do you want to meet my friends? And I said, your friends? He goes, yeah these are my friends, they want to play with me. I'm like, okay. So anyway, he was playing and then he, he said, well, they want to know if they can go home with us. And I said, absolutely not. They have to stay here. They are not allowed. They're not riding with us and they're not allowed to come. They're not allowed to come home with us. He goes, but Nana, they said they'll be really good. I'm like, nope, not allowed. They're staying here. So anyway, I think that had happened probably around noonish or so, noon or one, and then it was time to go. He said, Nana, they said that they can get their own way there. 
and they'll follow us. And I said, no, they're not coming home with us. They're staying here. And so he said, like, okay. And um, so when we was leaving, we went out of the building and we went down the stairs, went out of the building. And before I walked to the car, I turned around and I said, Wyatt, your friends are not with us, are they? And he's like, no, Nana, you told them they couldn't come. So they could, they didn't, they didn't follow us out. I'm like, okay, I just want to make sure they are not out of that building. They're not getting in my car and they're not coming to my house. <laughs> he's like, no, Nana, they did it. And he, I don't think he came to my office for a few months after that. And then I had asked him, I said, Wyatt, do you ever talk to the friends? He's like, no, but I haven't seen them no more. Creepy. I don't like that. No, no, no. Okay. Sorry, I'm just a little bit everywhere. So let's see if we can peel these off. Let's see what colors these. Oh, it's very light. It comes off might be hard for you guys to see those are pretty I like those this one's about the same color as some of my sunspots on my hands but that one's a really pretty color but anyway I gotta ask for my money back at least on one because it is broken okay so let's see what I got in here a frosted tea bag with nothing in it. Nothing in it. Um, oh, you know what I think these are? Yes. Okay. These, these two things that I'm about to show you, um, I won these as a gift on the game because I have um, Timo on both my phones, on my work phone and on my personal phone. I finally won, I don't remember, I think I won Farmland. Um, and I think these are the ones from Farmland from one of my phones. Um, let's see. This is matte liquid lipstick. And I have some of this, I've, I have this brand um, makeup at the house. Um, I don't remember what I got. Maybe it was more lipstick. And I think, if I remember right, I think we liked it. Oh, those are pretty. You guys can see those. This one is probably will be my go-to. I really like it. Um, let me use you guys as a mirror. Let's see. Oh no. I don't really like that. It's more. You know what? We are going to. Put it on the back of our hands. It's kind of, mm, I don't think I like it, but I could always mix it with a different color. So let's see. This looks like it's going to be kind of. purple. This one looks like apricot. That one's really pretty. That one's really pink. So let me just show you guys these other colors. But 
those are the colors that are in there. I think I like the fourth and the sixth, possibly. But we'll let them dry and see how it goes. But I got a little bitty box, really cute. these and I might get this one away um, to my sister-in-law this one's cute though and I like how it has the green So the green light, you could see the clean. The red is hot. And the blue is massage. Oh, I like that. I like that a lot. And is it this way? Yes comes with a cord. So cute. And then this next bag of stuff, I we opened it because we didn't know what it was. We was thinking that it was my husband's, but let me, well, I'll show you what I got. grab it before we get off but I got Wyatt one of these ones before and it's one of these um, portable mini printers oh goodness I think he had a blue one too I don't remember but he loved it so again this may be something um Sharshar has a birthday coming up, so this might go to Charlotte. Yep, and I'm going to have to get her some more um, paper because... with the paper but I think she'll like it again we'll see if that's what happens um, and I gotta get her list together and get her something and then this Hmm. I don't know what this is. I know at one time I had in there, but you know how sometimes it says, oh, your gifts, because it took me forever, like six months or seven months, can be upgraded. I had like the case where it's like paint pins or something. I don't remember if I kept that or if I changed it. Uh, nope, that's exactly what this is. Okay. And these it is fine markers. And there are tons of colors in here. I don't remember how many pieces, but that's 
that's really cute. Look at all that. I like it. I like it, like it, like it. And I like the little bag it comes in. So, you know, again, I might save this as a gift. We'll see. Um, and then, let me grab the other thing. Hold on one second. Grab it, grab it, grab it. Okay. I got this. It took me a long time to figure out what it was. And this goes in between your seats in your car. So it holds your purse or whatever. And then it has, I'm assuming it goes like this. And so um, when it's in between your seats, it's gonna be like this, just because it has the two pockets right here. And then it opens up pretty wide. Oh, let me just show you the bottom. It's that wide. And so you can fit your purse or whatever. And it has, um, let's see, it goes like, just not working out like I want it to, but like this, it's open. And so whenever you get in, you just throw it in there. I'm assuming it goes to where. This would be facing you just because of the pockets, but I don't know. I don't know. I got all my stuff to do my car, and I need to get it done. I need to get it cleaned and um, get everything that I got put in there. So... All right, well, that's it for those few bags that I got. I do have another bag at home I wanna open um, because I've had it probably three weeks. So I wanna go through and make sure nothing's broken like that. And because I've been so busy, I really thought about doing like a mask. So I might do that one day. Um, I don't know, there's so many things I wanna do. It's just finding the time to do them. So, all right, well, that was my small little haul, 33 minutes in, and um, story time, ghost story time, but I have more stories I can tell, and I can do that, and I'll save some for Halloween, too, so. All right, guys, thanks for joining me. Um, I'm excited. I missed being able to come on here and chat with everybody um, and just talk to you. I really do enjoy doing this. Um, and I think I've got some new subscribers and I'm so grateful, um, to get the new subscribe, new friends. I got new friends. Um, I am behind on watching my videos, so I gotta do that yesterday. I think I got to watch like four of them and I comment on every one of them and I find some really good stuff. Queen's Life, she went to their, the dollar store where she's at and she found sunglasses that are like readers, but they're sunglasses. She got her, I think like four pair. I'm gonna do the same if I find them. Um, I watched Adrian, and she held some really awesome stuff, right? I can't remember everything right on hand. Um, more than two cents. She did some really cute Halloween stuff. And Cheryl for Peace. She did a haul. Um, like I said, I can't remember everything because I was just trying to go through and watch everybody. Um, and watch everybody. And uh, just hear how, how everything's going. Oh, my mind just went blank right there. Anyway, just go on there, get caught up with everybody, see how everybody's doing. And um, I like getting all kinds of new ideas that everybody hauls because most of the time I don't see the things that they haul in my in my um, feed. And so I really like going through there and 
see what everybody else finds and then if they can post the links then I'll just put it in my cart um so yeah I need um decorations for this office the other office I couldn't hang anything on the wall here they're like hang paint do whatever you want so I'm excited to do that um just kind of make it my own little space so I do want to you know go on there and see what you guys do for decorating I know um just Jen does a lot of decorating um and who else there's a few people that are really good um with their decorations that they buy so I'm a little bit jealous that I don't I don't um I don't feel like I'm very creative and so I like to hear what they do but all right guys thanks for joining me today uh, don't forget to like and subscribe I really do appreciate each and every one of you um yeah yeah, my mind's just going blank now because I'm seeing people walking because they're getting ready to leave. So, all right, guys, I'm going to get off here. I've kept John here long enough. But again, thank you guys. Um, and I will talk to you guys soon. Bye. Hey, I'm walking to the old office. I have to turn in my keys. Oops. Sorry. So, I thought I would show you guys what the old office look like. Hold on. No. I'm just gonna turn phone around. All right, so here we go. No, I'm gonna stop this, hold on. I'm out of breath because I ran up the stairs. Hold on. Okay, this was my old office. We were here for, gosh, I was here for 10 or 11 years, 13, 11 years. I started here in 13. So, and then I had this little kitchen area right here. Well, I turned it into a kitchen area. I'm gonna miss it but I'm excited I'm gonna show you guys the new office I think there's some um, the neighbors that are on the other side of this wall I think they're gonna rent it they're gonna put a doorway to come into here so uh, I just thought I'd show you guys the old one um, I got to turn my keys in really fast and I'll show you the downstairs early 1900s and it is haunted I'll have to tell you guys some stories but let me uh, see if I can slide them under this door hold on a second I don't know if I can hold on this is it and this is the picture of what the downtown area looks like and I want to see if I can show you this other one, but I don't really want to show you the location. Hold on a second. This picture was taken in 17, no, not 1766. But it's the building that I'm in right now. So, okay, well, that's it. Now I'm going to go to my new office. Um, I will show you guys the new office in just a few. Okay, so this is the new office. It's smaller. Um, let's see if I can. There we go. It is a complete mess. We're still building furniture. Um, an extra chair because I didn't have any chairs. And this is my husband's setup for building. He finished my desk finally, but I have a bookshelf and a chair that still needs to be done. But I like the double windows. 
like I said, complete mess. Please excuse the mess. Um, here is the completed desk. I love, 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 love it. Um, but it's small. It's tiny. I did get another second room. Um, that's my trash right there. <laughs> I didn't know. It's all a learning experience that um, on Mondays they don't have the cleaning service in here. So hopefully they'll come get it today. But I'll take you guys to the other room. Right now I'm using it as a storage room. But it will be like my kitchenette area. Because this is pretty tiny. I want to say it's like uh, 12 by 14, I believe. Um, but the other office is right across the hall. So because it's a full building, I'm not going to talk while I go across the hall. Um, let me see if there's anybody. I just won't talk, but I'll just show you. Hold on. It is a library. I love it. Oh, hold on. I gotta get my keys. I'm just taking you guys along for the ride while I search for everything. I said it is a complete mess but here's the second office um, that is all just trash from the desk it does have a small window that looks out to the library um, but yeah I got a lot of work to do a lot of work to do but I'll get it done I'll get it done but I just wanted to show you guys um, the before and the after will be a lot better, so. All right, I will talk to you guys later, bye.